conversation in the hospital with somebody who has dementia can be excruciating. <laughs> so if, if you have a parent that's been in the hospital or is in the hospital, if they're in a skilled nursing facility, if they're in a board and care assisted living, but they have that cognitive loss, they have dementia, they have Alzheimer's, how do you really have a conversation with them? If you're like me, you screw it up all the time. I ask too many questions. <laughs> hey, how's it going today? I don't know how's it going. I, I don't know. What did you have for dinner uh, You know, earlier? What did you have for lunch? They can't answer these questions. So you gotta be very careful asking questions to somebody with dementia. That's hard for me to remember. What I do now is I use a tool. I use pictures to communicate. So instead of asking these questions that can't, can't really be answered, I bring a stack of pictures and we go through these pictures and you know I show her a picture of what she looked like when she was in her uh, 20s. And I show her pictures with her mom and dad and her uh, when uh, they got all dressed up for some occasion. Um, and this allows her to, to laugh and reminisce a little bit because she can recall the, the things that were a long way from her, but she has a real hard time recalling anything recent. Even her closest friends or people that she's known for the last 20, 30, 40, 50 years, she has a hard time recalling those people, but she can go back further than that. This has been something that I have found very, very successful, entertaining for me as well, because I like to go back and look at, look at pictures. And uh, you know, I would suggest to you that you give it a shot. You, I think you're gonna find that, you know, it breaks some of the monotony of just trying to have a conversation over and over again, uh, which can really lead to a lot of burnout. So good luck with that. Let me know if it, it works and then, uh, you know, if you need any help finding assisted living, care homes, or caregiving, you know who to call. All right, talk to you soon.